Today we want to tell you six things you should know before getting a French Bulldog. It's not that we don't love him, because we love him. We love him a lot. It's just we would love to have a heads up before we got him. Just like, oh, by the way, he does a few things that you should be aware of. So, before we got Sven, Dulcidio watched all of those movies about uh, French Bulldogs, how cute they are, you know, what uh, they can do, and that they want to snuggle and be with you all the time. And but no one told me the reality behind that. True. Oh, nice bird there. Yeah. Number one. Farts. Yes, they tell you that French Bulldogs fart, but they don't tell you how terribly it smells. I think this is the most disturbing thing they don't tell you before you get a French Bulldog. Well, they tell you in a way that, oh, French Bulldogs farts like, yeah, he makes noises from his rear end. But they don't tell you that they can clear a room in seconds or wake you up during night with just a single fart in the same room. And they really smell terrible. Fact number two. They snore. Yes, they snore like humans or worst. <laughs> no, they snore just like humans. I have one snoring example. I sing while I sleep, <laughs> which is different. By the way, <laughs> my husband snores much more than Sven, but once uh, I couldn't fall asleep and both of them were snoring and uh, I recorded them and sometimes I play it to people and it's impossible to recognize who snores louder. Is it Sven or Dulcidio? Fact number three, butt cleaning. No one ever told us before about this. Getting a French Bulldog, it's like having a baby. Yes. You have to... Wipe his butt every time he goes to the bathroom. So, no one told us about this. No. And it became daily life. Or else you will suffer the consequences anywhere he decides to turn around can be your sofa, your wall, your pants, or even your t-shirt if you decided to put him on your lap. Fact number four. They ignore you a lot. Yes, it looks like he's going to listen to you because of the big ears, but the truth is that those big ears are just pure decoration. They are not for listening. Well, maybe it's just bad parenting. No, it's not. We do good work, I hope. Don't we, Gaia? Fact number five. Cheater, cheater, compulsive eater. Yes, he loves food. We haven't found a limit for him. It's whatever, whenever. As long as it's reachable for him, he will have it. So if we are cooking, he will sit next to us like a ninja and he will wait for the food to fall on the floor and eat it. True. I think if you would let him into his 12 kilo bag of food, he would eat everything. He even ate my microphone, I'll show you. Whatever is edible, he can find it and eat it. Look at him. All day running, non-stop, and he's exhausted. He's dead. He doesn't have energy for anything. This is going to be the sacrificed fruit. Maria, go for it. He, he saw that a victim was caught and the predator is coming to see if he can get a bit of this. Look at this, he comes and he attacks. Look how he attacks with his sweet eyes, begging for a tiny bit of apple. And by the way, he just had his dinner, like, I don't know, half an hour ago? Yeah, so he had a full bowl and look how he is. He's like, are you, going, are you not going to share that with me? You know, give me a bit, give me a bit. And that's how French Bulldogs hunt. 
they try to make you feel bad by eating the fruit and then they come with these big eyes and sad face and they beg for more. Fact number six. He follows us everywhere. Yes, Sven actually follows us all the time around the house. He never let us stay a second long. And that's, that's awesome for the days that you feel lonely, but for the days that you are in a hurry and you need to go somewhere, or you carry a baby and you need to go up and down with the baby and he's around your legs all the time, it's annoying. See, and yes, and also he not only follows you, as also he tries to predict where are you going, so he goes ahead of you. I hope the camera caught this fart, because we could listen from here. In general, we love our dog. He's cute French bulldog. He's very nice and lovely and... Full of energy. And yes. they said that he'd be like, no, no, French bulldog, they just stay and sleep. He is sleeping and laying down right now, but he spent all day running and playing with other dogs. So he's like exhausted. And then we know that today and tomorrow he's going to sleep all day. And if he sees a ball, he can spend the whole day chasing the ball. And if you are thinking about getting a French bulldog, this video is not to, you know, stop you from doing that. In general, we have no problems. He's a healthy dog. He's a funny dog. Everybody loves him. He's full of energy. And he, he loves wants... everybody. Yes, and he wants to go and say hi to everybody. So if you want to get a French Bulldog, we can recommend. He's awesome, but his farts may kill you. He tricked me into getting a French Bulldog. He was uh, watching all these cute movies and then he took me to the breeder and there was this little cute dog running around so happy and everything and I just fell in love. And we got to spend. See you next time. See ya.